everyone, I'm Kenzie. I'm the fitness coordinator here at UNT Rec Sports, and today we are going to do hip boxing. I hope that you are able to join me from the comfort of your own home. Um, and I do want to just let you know that we are going to be doing some uh, boxing combinations and cardio spikes throughout this workout, but feel free to modify in any way that you uh, feel best. And um, I want to make sure that you're really making this your own workout. Um, not my workout, it is your workout. And so feel free to do what you need. If you want to take it back, scale it back a little bit, I'll try to provide as many options as possible. Um, or feel free to challenge yourself a little extra, um, however you feel you need. Um, you can also feel free to take a break um, at any time, grab a drink of water, take a break. Um, you can take any of the intervals out or just click pause and then come back to me when you're ready. Um, so we're gonna start out with a little warm up and um, so first of all, I want you to come to uh, with your shoulder, your feet shoulder width apart, and we're going to practice our footwork first. So that um, every single time you throw a punch today, I want your feet to be rotating. So make sure you're on a ground that you can rotate your feet. Um, ideally, you have some tennis shoes on as well, um, just to make sure you don't slip or fall. So I want your feet shoulder width apart. I want your hands to come up on guard, and you're just going to hold your core nice and tight and rotate back and forth. So this is how I want your feet to be rotating uh, through the entire workout as you're throwing your punches. All right, holding that core tight, your feet are rotating on the balls of your feet. There you go. Perfect, now we are going to switch to our uh, traditional stance. So actually I'm gonna have you put your left foot forward and I'm going to have you slide your right foot back like they're on railroad tracks. Your hands are going to come up on guard. And I'm going to have you do a jab with that front arm and cross with your rear arm. So jab and cross. We're just going to go through all of our punches that we're going to do in our workout today and uh, give them a little bit of practice. So remember, every punch that you throw, your feet are rotating. Your core is held tight. All right. Nice job. We are going to switch and try our hooks. So that front arm comes to a circular motion and that rear arm. Front arm hook, rear arm hook. There you go. So as you're doing your workout today, imagine that you have an opponent right in front of you at all times. For the hook, you are uh, going for that opponent's cheek. Nice job. All right, we're switching on to our uppercut. So you're going to dip down, bring that motion upward. And then same thing with the rear arm. So front arm uppercut, rear arm uppercut. Good, so on this one, I don't wanna see any flying or swinging arms. I want you to dip down and put your entire torso into the uppercut. Perfect. All right, so we're gonna practice all of these on the other side as well. So this is called your south paw stance with your right leg forward. Hands are up on guard. You're gonna give me a jab with that front arm and cross with your rear arm. Jab and cross, rotating on your feet with every movement. There you go. Nice work. All right, let's practice the hook on this side. So circular motion, going for that opponent's cheek. So front arm, rear arm. This one's really important to make sure you're rotating on those feet so that you don't twist your knee. There you go. All right, let's switch it. We've got our uppercut. So dip that shoulder down and power comes up. We're going for that opponent's chin. There you go. Rotating on those feet. Starting to add a little bit more power as you're getting warmer. Good work. All right, so let's warm up that lower body. Your feet are gonna come nice and wide and we're going to just do a nice side lunge, side to side. We are gonna do a few kicks today. So just kind of moving through this motion as you feel. All right, our next one, we're gonna come feet, move your feet in a little bit closer, about shoulder width apart. You're gonna sit down into a squat and then you're gonna give me a reverse lunge. So in that squat, once your feet or your heels on the ground, stand up, Switch your legs that are going back. Squat, reverse lunge. Squat, reverse lunge. Good. All right, we're gonna 
switch this one to a squat. You're gonna grab up tall, bring that knee up. Squat, knee drive. Squat, knee drive. Alternating knees each time. Very good. All right, we're gonna practice one of our kicks today. So you're gonna give me a reverse lunge. Knee comes up, you're gonna snap kick forward. Okay, reverse lunge with the other foot. Knee comes up, snap kick forward. So on that snap kick, your knee or your toe is pointed and you're gonna make it nice and quick so that opponent doesn't grab your foot. Knee comes up, snap kick forward. All right, give me one more. Nice job. All right, so at this point you should be feeling a little bit warmed up. And I know I am, I'm like a little bit breathless already. But we're gonna jump into our um, four different combinations that I have planned for you today. Each one is going to be for, for 60 seconds. And then uh, we will do a 30 second cardio spike attached onto it. We will do four different combinations that I'll do with you. And then we are going to add something else onto the end of each of those as well. So we'll do, whew, I'm breathing hard already. We'll do a, um, MMA plus, an MMA round, and then followed up with an MMA plus round. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. So I want your left leg forward uh, to start out with. So we are going to do this combination for 60 seconds. So you're going to give me a jab, a cross, and a front arm uppercut. All right, so starting with that 60 seconds in three, two, one. Jab, cross, front uppercut. Jab, cross, front uppercut. So remember, uh, think about that form. You're twisting your feet with every punch. Holding that core tight. Once you get the hang of the combination, you can go a little bit faster, but I want you to stay in control and make sure you're adding that power. You still have that opponent that's right in front of you. Great job. Jab, cross, uppercut. Good. At your own pace, how many of the combination can you get in in the 60 seconds? You got this. You're almost there. Jab, cross, upper. In 10 seconds, we're gonna go for our first cardio spike. So, I want you to come down into a plank position. You're gonna give me four round climbers. One, two, three, four, and two plank jacks. All right, three, two, one, 30 seconds, let's go. One, two, three, four, one, and two. You can always step those feet in and out if that feels better than a jumping. There you go. Four mountain climbers, two plank jacks. Make sure those shoulders are right over the top of your wrists. 10 seconds to go. Great job, three, two, and one. Come on back up, great job. Now we have to do the same combination on the other side. So go ahead and bring your right leg forward. We're in our south paw stance, all right? The combination is a jab, cross, and front uppercut, all right? 60 seconds, let's go. That right leg is in front. You're leading with that right arm, following through with the other. Jab, cross, and upper. Nice job. You got it at your own pace here. Nice and slow, think about that form. And once you get confident with it, bring it as fast as you can, or you'd like to do. Hold that core tight. Good job. Jab, cross, uppercut. Make sure that guard stays up, protecting your face at all times. You got this. Jab, cross, upper. There you go. 10 seconds, we're going back down to our plank position. You get four mountain climbers and two plank jacks. Ready? Hand, or hands on the floor, plank position. Let's go. Four mountain climbers, two plank jacks, Really hold that core tight. And I wanna see 
You let hanging hey, here going up or sagging down. There you go. Nice job. Almost there. You've got this. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, guys. Come on back up to a stand. Catch your breath. Shake it out. We're already on combination number two. Go ahead and do what you need to do at this time, and then we'll move on to our second combination. All right, so we're gonna come back to our left leg forward, starting in traditional stance again. Our second combination is fun because we get to throw a few elbows. So uh, we are going to, our combination is a jab, a rear arm up elbow, and a front side elbow. So I want you to tuck your hand in as close as you can to your shoulder and just hit with your elbow, okay? So we're gonna give that jab, rear arm up elbow like you're slicking back your hair, and then a front side elbow. Ready? Jab, up, and side. Jab, up elbow, side elbow. There you go. Jab, up elbow, side elbow. Hold that core tight, rotating on those feet. Jab, up, side. Jab, up, inside. Keep it up, let's go. You're almost there. Jab, up, side. You got it. At your own pace here, how many combinations can you get? Jab, up elbow, side elbow. Tuck those hands in. You're only hitting with your elbow. Jab, up, inside. In 10 seconds, we have our cardio spike. I'm gonna have you do a reverse lunge, knee drive up, and a lateral hop. Ready, and go. Reverse lunge, knee drive, and lateral hop. Now you can take that jump out if you'd like, okay? Only going down as far as you can in that lunge. Staying in control. Make sure that knee is facing forward, pointing toward your toes. Let's get in as many as you can. Explode through your feet, or take that jump out if you need. Nice job, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, good job. We gotta do everything on our right side that we just did. All right, so your right leg is forward, hands are up on guard. You're gonna give me jab, rear up elbow, and front side elbow, ready? Go. 60 seconds. Jab, up elbow, side elbow. Jab, up, side. Jab, up, side. Feet rotating, core held tight. Jab, up, side. There you go. Nice job. Following through with each punch. Hold that core tight, add that power. That opponent's right in front of you. Stay strong. There you go. Jab, up elbow, side elbow. Nice job, guys. All the way through to 60 seconds, you're almost there. All right, 10 seconds to go. We're going back for a reverse lunge and lateral hop. Reverse lunge back, knee drive, Lateral hop, let's go, 30 seconds. Up and over, good. Really pushing off of that planted foot as much as you can, add that power. Okay, you can always take that jump out. Knee is pointed towards your toes, you've got this. Almost there guys, power through. Five, four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Shake it out. Take a little breather. Uh, we are going to switch on to combination number three. Feel free to pause me and grab a drink and come back whenever you are ready. Um, then we're gonna hop right into combination number three. So we're gonna go back to our traditional stance. So your left leg is forward. Slide that right throw back and your hands are up on guard. Okay, on this one, 
we, we're throwing in some defensive moves, okay? So on this one, we've got a double jab, cross, and roll, okay? With that roll, your opponent's throwing a hook at you, you've gotta get underneath it, okay? So keep those eyes up, squat down, and get right underneath that roll, or that hook. Okay, ready? Double jab, cross, and roll. There you go. Good. Double jab, cross, roll. Hands stay up on guard, protect your face. There you go. In that roll, make sure that your heels stay on the floor and you sit down as low as you can. Nice job, eyes on your opponent at all times. Double jab, cross, and roll. How many can you get in? Keep it up. Nice work, guys. Almost there. Let's do this. 10 seconds left, and we are going to our next cardio spike, which is, you're gonna pretend you have a medicine ball. And you're going to slam it on the floor. Ready? Let's go. Grab that medicine ball, slam it on the floor. Add that hop at the top if you can. Okay, you've got a really heavy medicine ball. Slam it down. Okay, you don't have to jump if you don't want. Reach up tall and exert that force down. There you go. 10 seconds left. Let's keep it up. Three. Two, and one. Nice job. All right, south paw stand, same combination. Your right leg is forward, slide that left foot back. Your hands up on guard, okay? We're going for that double jab, cross, and roll underneath. Let's go, 60 seconds. Double jab, cross, and roll. Double jab, cross, and roll. Good job. Keep those hands up. Return your hand as soon as you throw that punch. Protecting that face. You've got it. Double jab, cross, then roll underneath. Keep those shoulders up. No looking at the floor or dipping those shoulders down. Cross, and roll. Almost there guys, keep it up. How many can you get? Double jab, cross, and roll. We're going for that cardio spike here in five seconds. All right, grab that medicine ball. Let's go, 30 second cardio spike, slam it down. Adding that jump at the top if you can. Otherwise, just rising onto those toes, adding that powerful slam down. Good job, getting that heart rate going. You've got this. Slam it down. Finish it out, guys. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, shake it out. I'm breathing hard. So, if you need to take a break, feel free to do so. I, I do have one more combination to teach you before um, we have a break and then we'll do our MMA plus round. So, on to combo number four. Moving back to that traditional stance. Your left leg is forward again. Hands are up on guard, okay? So, we have another defensive move. So, you need to protect your body. So, we're gonna throw up a rear arm block. Then we're gonna dip down low for a hook to their body. And then we're gonna finish with a cross up top. So, this looks like rear arm block, a body hook down low, and cross up to the nose, okay? Let's do this, 60 seconds. Block, hook down low, cross up high. Block, hook, and cross. So you're starting with your rear arm. Lock, hook, and cross. There you go. Make sure those feet are pivoting with every motion. You've got this. Block, hook, and cross. There you go. Keep it up, guys. I know you're getting tired. Stick with it. You're going at your own pace. 
You're almost there. Keep it up. Block, hook, and cross. 10 seconds to go until our cardio spike. So our last cardio spike that we have is a ground to fighter stance. You're gonna get on your belly on the floor and you're gonna pop back up to a fighter stance. Ready? Let's go. 30 seconds. Now if you need a modification for this, go ahead, plank position, step your feet in and out, up to fighter. Okay, here we go. You've got this, how many can you give me? Another alternative to this exercise is running in place. You've got this, almost there. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, good job. Other side. So your right leg is forward, south cross stance. Hand, uh, hands are up on guard. You've got that rear arm block, body hook, and cross up high. Ready, let's go. Block, hook, cross. Block, hook, and cross. Yes, you've got this guys. Rear arm block, hook down low, cross up high. Good job. Keep it up all the way to the end. You can do this. Rotating those feet, hold that core tight. Hands are on guard. Block, hook, cross. Nice work. Stay strong, guys. Let's finish it out. Block, hook, cross. There you go. 10 seconds to go. We've got those round to fighter stands coming for us. Ready? Let's hit it. Down to the floor. And pop back up. Ready to fight. And your alternative is stepping those feet in and out and back up. At your own pace, how many can you get? Nice job, nice job. If you need to return to another exercise, jogging in place. Good work, 10 seconds. Let's finish it out. Three, two, and one. Nice work. All right guys, this is a great opportunity to grab a little drink of water. Uh, pause me for maybe a minute or two and then come on back. We are going to do, uh, for our MMA plus round, we will be doing um, all of those same combinations and then add one or two elements onto the end. So you're very confident with the whole first part and then we'll add one or two new things to the end of it, okay? So let's go hop into that MMA plus round. I'm gonna have you start in traditional stance again. So your left leg is forward, your hands are up on guard. We are um, going back to that jab, cross, uppercut. We're gonna add a cross and a front hook. All right, so let's do this. Jab, cross, uppercut, cross, hook. You've got this. Upper, cross, and hook. Nice job. Jab, cross, uppercut, cross, hook. There you go. Jab, cross, upper, cross, hook. Keep it up, let's go. All the way to the end. Jab, cross, upper, cross, hook. Jab, cross, upper, cross, hook. Rotating on those feet. Hold that core tight. You've got this. Jab, cross, uppercut, cross, hook. Give me one more, we've got 10 seconds left. We're going back to the four mountain climbers and two plank jacks. So down in a plank position, 30 seconds. Let's go. Four mountain climbers, two plank jacks. You can step or jump those feet in and out, whatever you prefer. You've got this. Hold that core tight. Good job. Squeeze your glutes. Almost there guys, power through. 10 seconds left. Breathe. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Back on your feet. 
All right, we are switching to our southpaw stance. So your right leg is forward, your hands are up on guard. We've got a jab, cross, uppercut, cross, hook. All right, again, jab, cross, upper, cross, hook. There you go, nice job. Jab, cross, upper, cross, hook. Again. Nice job, everyone. Jab, cross, uppercut, cross, hook. Rotating on those feet, hold that core tight. Nice job. Jab, cross, upper, cross, hook. Keep it up. We've got this. Jab, cross, upper, cross, hook. Let's finish strong. 10 seconds to go. We're going back for those mountain climbers and plank jacks. On the floor, plank position. Your body is level to the floor. Ready, let's go. 30 seconds, four mountain climbers, two plank jacks. Step four, jump those feet in and out. You've got this. Breathe all the way through it. Good work, good work. Keep it up guys, all the way to the end. 10 seconds to go. Good job, good job. Three, two, and one. All right, on your feet. We are already on our second combination of the MMA plus round. So go ahead and bring your left leg forward. Your hands are up on guard. So this is the one with the elbows. So we did a jab, rear arm up elbow, front side elbow. Now you're gonna give me a double knee. Okay, remember you've got that opponent. And I want you to throw your knee at him, give it some power. Don't just lift up your knee. All right, let's do this. Okay, left leg forward, you got a jab, up elbow, front elbow, knee, and knee. Nice job, jab, up elbow, side elbow, reach, knee, knee. Good job. Jab, up elbow, side elbow, knee, knee. Again. Keep those feet on the swivel, core held tight. Add that power. There you go. Nice job, guys. Let's finish this out. Up, side, knee, knee. Jab, up elbow, side elbow, knee, knee. Good job, 10 seconds, we're going for that cardio spike. You're gonna lunge back, knee drive, lateral jump. Starting in five, four, three, two, one. Reverse lunge, knee drive up, lateral hop. Okay, you can take that jump out if you need. Only go down in that lunge as far as you can control. You want your knee facing straight forward towards your toes. Keep that foot flat on the ground and explode to those toes. Good job. Keep it up, 10 seconds left. Power through. Let's do this. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. All right, other side. South cloth stance. Your hands are up on guard, right foot is forward. We've got that jab, rear up elbow, front side elbow, double knee. Let's do this. Jab, up, side, knee, knee. There you go. Jab. Up elbow, side elbow, knee, knee. There you go, you've got this. Jab, up, side, knee, knee. Get that game face on, I know you're getting tired. We're still in this. Good job, guys. Jab, up elbow, side elbow, knee, knee. Almost there. Keep it up. Jab, up, side, knee, knee. All right, going for that 30 second cardio spike. Reverse lunge, knee drive, lateral hop. Let's go. Reverse lunge, knee drive, 
lateral hop. How many can you get in this 30 seconds? Challenge yourself, push yourself. We're towards the end of the workout. You've got this. Add that jump or take it out. It's up to you. Stay in control. Good work, guys. 10 seconds. Finish it out. Nice job. Three, two, and one. Shake it out. Catch your breath. Grab yourself a drink of water if you need. We have two combinations left to go of our MMA plus round, and then we'll cool down quick, okay? So your left leg comes forward again. Hands are up on guard. We're going back to that combination that we did, a double jab, cross, roll, and then we're gonna come up and add a rear arm hook, okay? Let's go, 60 seconds, double jab, cross, roll underneath, now throw a, a hook, sorry, okay? We got a double jab, cross, roll underneath their hook, and then throw a hook right back at them. There you go. Get down as low as you can. Nice job. Rotating on those feet. Good work, double jab, cross, roll underneath, throw that hook. You've got this guys, at your own pace here. Double jab, cross, roll, rear arm hook. Almost there, let's go. Keep it up, 10 seconds left until our cardio spike, which we are going back to those jumping mid ball slams. Let's grab that med ball. This time we're gonna go side to side. Let's go, 30 seconds. Med ball slam to the side and to the other side. Okay, working those obliques, pulling up with that opposite side. Each time, throw that ball down. Adding that jump at the top if you can. If not, rising onto those toes. That is okay too. Good job, 10 seconds left. Let's do this. Three, two, and one. Nice job. Other side, so southpaw stance. Your right leg is forward. Hands up on guard. You're starting with that double jab. Cross, roll to the back, come on up. Rear arm hook. Double jab, cross, roll, and hook. There you go. Nice work, everyone. Roll and hook, hold that core tight, add that power. You're all warmed up now. Keep that game face on. Good work, double jab, cross, roll, and hook. Nice work, let's go all the way to the end. Double jab, cross, roll, hook. 10 seconds to go. Back to those med ball slams. Get set, going side to side. Three, two, one. Slam the ball, side to side. Adding that jump if you wish. Nice work. Let's get that heart rate up. Good job, keep it up. You got this. All the way to the end. Let's go, 10 seconds left. You can do this. Five, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. All right guys, we've got one more left to go. We can do this. All right, we're starting with our traditional leg. Left leg forward, hands up on guard. We've got a new kick coming for us. So we're starting with that rear arm block Body hook down low, cross up high, you're gonna step in and side kick. So I want you to flex your foot and stamp it into the wall in front of you for your computer. All right, let's do this. Rear arm block, body hook down low, cross up high, step in and side kick. Block, hook, cross, step it in, side kick. You almost have to tilt your hips to the side so that your body can lean like a table, okay? Rear block, hook, cross, step it in, side kick. 
Walk, hook, cross, side kick. Again. You got this, finish it out. Block, hook, cross. Nice job. Let's finish it out. Block, hook, cross, side kick. All right guys, we're going back for those ground to pop up into fighter stance. You can jog in place if you wish. Let's go, 30 seconds. All the way down or to plank position, jumping or stepping those feet out, pop them back up. Ready to fight. Finish it out strong. Either stepping those feet in and out or jumping. Or you can jog in place. Still getting that heart rate spiked. 10 seconds to go. Let's finish it out. Five, four, three, two. And one, good job. All right, your last side, south paw stance. Put that right leg in front, hands up on guard. Okay, we got that rear arm block, body hook down low, cross up high, step it in, side kick. Reset, rear arm block, hook down low, cross up high, step in, side kick. Reset, block, hook, cross, in, Side kick, keep that foot flexed. You're stamping your foot right into that camera. Block, hook, cross, in, side kick. There you go. Make sure you're staying on the balls of your feet, pivoting with every punch. Good work guys, finish it out, let's do this. And again, block, hook, Cross, step it in, side kick, reset. You're almost there. 10 seconds to go. We're going back to those ground to fighter stance or jogging in place is your alternative. Three, two, one, let's go. Pop it back up, ready to fight. Alternating your feet, that come forward. Let's go. Your last part of this fight, you can do this. Finish it out strong. Keep breathing. You've got it. 10 seconds to go. Let's finish it out. You've got this, guys. Three, two, and one. Nice job. All right, catch your breath. Maybe grab a drink of water real quick. And then we'll do a quick cool down as well. So, to jump into that cool down, go ahead and bring your right foot behind you. We'll do a quad stretch. Very good. Go ahead, bring that right foot forward. Plant your heel into the floor. You're gonna bend over at your hips so that front leg stays straight and until you have a stretch in the hamstring with your front leg. Okay, go ahead and bring your right foot behind you for a lunge. Now push your hips forward so that you feel that stretch in your hip flexors. And then you're gonna bring your right arm across uh, close to your body. Let those back muscles relax. Good. Right, go ahead and step your right foot in a little bit closer. Push your heel down to the floor as far as you can to get that calf stretch. You're gonna bring your right arm behind you for that tricep stretch. Nice deep breath, keep your chin up tall. Very good. All right, go ahead and grab your left foot to behind you for that quad stretch. Feel free to grab onto something for balance or find a spot on the floor maybe that helps you balance. All right, bring that left foot in front of you, plant your heel into the floor, bring your bend over at your hips, feel that hamstring stretch in the back of your left leg. Right, your 
left foot comes behind you for a lunge position. Push your hips forward so you feel that hip flexor stretch. Now you're bringing your left arm across for that upper back stretch. Good, bring that back foot in a little ways. Push your heel down to the floor as far as you can for that calf stretch and your left arm comes behind your head. Very good, all right, last one. Let's clasp your hands in the back and reach up as far as you can. Stick your chest out, nice big deep breath. Letting that heart rate come down. Stretching out those upper body muscles. All right, thank you everyone for joining me. Feel free to do some more stretching. I know that was a very tough workout. I hope you were able to modify as needed. Uh, we will be posting um, more formats uh, for uh, exercises for you to do on our website. So please look out for more classes to do um, and always making them your own. Uh, from your own house. So thanks for joining me and see you next time.